I'm so sick of all this politic talk, bro. Every election, it's the same thing. Just a bunch of old geezers lying and gaslighting. Only time it gets interesting is when someone gets shot. Politics to me is like sports at this point. All it is is people picking a side and wanting the other side to lose. So I can't stand how people try to make me feel stupid for not caring about politics. Acting like they're more proper and elegant because they're tuned into a bunch of old people arguing over the same topics they've been arguing over for years. You turn on the news and there's this smug bum on there talking like he's so smart because he know big words like congression. Meanwhile, all they do is wake up every day, wear an expensive suit, just to go on the TV and complain in front of a mic. They're just like me. They're doing exactly what I'm doing, but want to act like they're superior because they're on TV in a suit. We're doing the same job. Only difference is I'm doing it butt naked. And folks are so easily manipulated. A politician will pay your favorite rapper to promote them. And now you're at the polls about a vote for somebody because Soldier Boy said so. And I hate how no one sees through the tactics that both sides be doing. Like they both want to win the election. Of course, they're going to say the worst things possible about the other side. Kamala's not even black. Trump wants to bring back slavery. Crooked Kamala wants to kill babies. Trump said the end word come out as a name and whenever it gets close to election time everyone you know becomes a political advisor all of a sudden that one crash that you follow online who commits crimes on instagram live and has never voted in his life is reposting threads about how the democrats want america to become fascist he don't even know what fascists mean i don't even know what fascists mean no one does research they all just repost anything that supports their stance <laughs> And why is the whole world involved in American politics? You have a guy from New Delhi, India on Twitter all day ranting about the political state of America under Biden's administration. He's never even been on US soil. He's never even committed a hate crime like a true American. We don't want to hear your opinion. And I hate when people make me feel bad for not being on their side as if their side is good and the other side is bad. According to the internet, if I vote for Trump, I'm a self-hating piece of black. If I vote for Kamala, I'm a... Both sides talk as if they're good guys. Meanwhile, they're both they're both bombing other countries for no reason like super villains. Instead of both sides just attacking each other and making the other look bad, why don't they start talking about the good things they're trying to do for the country? The fact that I know all the negative things about both candidates and nothing good about either is weird. I find myself having to do hours of research just to get the real explanation about what they're trying to do for America. Gotta dig through all the hit pieces and smear campaigns just to find out they said the most generic things like, I'm gonna stop the opioid epidemic. No, you're not. Not on my watch. Get it? I sell drugs! It's me! I'm the problem! Well, Josh, since you got it all figured out, who are you voting for? I can't vote. I'm a felon. Uh, my lawyer says not to mention anything past that and to also mention that I have no idea how that $8 million worth of meth ended up in my bedroom. So yeah, my point is these politicians all suck. If you're into politics, cool. But don't be toxic about it because your side sucks too. Which is why I'm announcing that I am running for president, job 2024. I'm bringing back jobs. Yeah. I'm lowering taxes. Yeah. I'm executing anyone who stands in my way. What? what? Yeah.